Hello everybody, this is Jacob with Nexus. I'm here at 377 Gaskill Street. This is located in Woonsocket, Rhode Island. A beautiful, stylish, colonial home here. Four bedroom, one and a half bathroom. Renovated, updated. And we're going to begin our walkthrough of this home right through the front entryway you have. So it leads up these steps, which then leads to your main foyer. Uh, the ground level houses your kitchen, double parlor, and your dining room. The second level houses your four bedrooms and full bathroom. And the third level houses a nice open loft area for lots of opportunity. So welcome. So you'll notice as we walk into the main foyer, you have beautiful wood trims throughout the entire home. This does of course house your stairway that leads up to the second floor and connects to the double parlor and dining room. So speaking of which, we're gonna to turn to our right, which then leads to the dining room. So a gorgeous hardwood flooring throughout most of the first floor. The kitchen houses a new laminate wood flooring, but again, a nice stylish wood trimming around the windows, around the door frames, looks awesome. The dining room houses a beautiful chandelier lighting in here. And this dining room has plenty of space for really any size dining set you'd like to have. So you have lots of opportunity in here. So from the dining room, it'll then lead to the double parlor that you have right around the corner. Again, gorgeous hardwoods and a nice coat of paint. You have a stylish decorative fireplace off to your left side in this side of the double parlor. I should also note you have a baseboard heat throughout the entire unit. The third floor actually houses a mini split, which I'll show off later. But this is your first side of the double parlor. Again, really wide open, high rise ceilings, uh, lots of opportunity in this home. Here's the other side of the double parlor. Awesome. Next, we'll check out the kitchen. So kitchen is beautifully updated. It has a newer laminate wood flooring, like I said, looks great in here. You have lots of storage in this kitchen, plenty of cabinets all around the appliances, as you can see. Uh, you also have a pretty large pantry closet in here as well. Wide open countertops, lots of outlets for additional kitchen plugins and a stylish backsplash, as you can see. But the big thing in here is all new appliances. This includes the brand new stainless steel refrigerator. You also have the stainless steel dishwasher, the Dubin sink, the brand new glass top, stove and oven, and the brand new built-in microwave. Very nice. And from there, we'll go ahead and check out the half bath. So the half bath, again, is housed on the ground level. Uh, it's, nothing's crazy, but you just have a nice little sink area as you enter. Off to the left is the toilet and some cabinetry above that for a little bit of storage for you. Sweet. So now let's go ahead and check out the second level. So again, this second floor houses your four bedrooms and full bathroom. And we'll start by checking out the bedroom right in front as you go up the stairwell. So three of the four bedrooms house a hardwood flooring. The fourth bedroom houses a carpet flooring. And again, high rise ceilings, plenty of space in all these bedrooms. I would say the smallest bedroom should be able to fit a full, full Excel, but all the rest should be able to fit queen or king size bed sets. This bedroom in particular houses a pretty large walk-in closet space over here. Just wanted to show that off. There's plenty of bedroom storage in here. This is probably one of the bedrooms I would say queen should be able to fit no problem at all. Very nice. Now we'll check out the bedroom that's straight to your right side as you walk up the stairs. This is the one bedroom that does house a carpet flooring. You do have your own closet. Uh, this is probably the smallest of the four bedrooms, but you should still be able to fit a standard full, full Excel. I could see this room maybe being used as a children's bedroom and or maybe as an office space uh, if it's just three occupants. Regardless, great opportunity in this room. Nevertheless, very nice. So that is the second bedroom we're looking at. Now we'll check out the third. This bedroom is right near the entryway to the loft upstairs. Again, a hardwood flooring, nice fresh coat of paint, wide open windows once again. And right around the corner, you have your closet space in the corner over there. 
And this bedroom might also think a queen should be able to fit no problem. Uh, it's obviously dependent on whatever you need, but this bedroom is another one that should be able to fit a queen size bed set, standard, full, full XL. All should be able to work in here. All right. Last bedroom is located at the end of the hall over here. And again, hardwood flooring, nice coat of paint, wide open windows, high rise ceilings. This bedroom also has a pretty large closet space, basically a walk-in closet that you have. So lots of storage available to you in these bedrooms, but all bedrooms do have their own closets. And this bedroom, I would probably say again, queen, king even, could work in here. So full, full XL, queen, king, easy enough. These bedrooms house lots of opportunity. All right, last but not least, we'll go ahead and poke upstairs and check out your loft area. Or actually next, forgot to mention, you do have the full bathroom up on the second floor, so we'll check that out first. Beautifully renovated, you have a new tile flooring in here, a brand new six space right here, wide open, lots of cabinets down below, wide open mirror up above, new light fixtures as well. Very bright with the window. And of course, a brand new setup of the tub over here. Full tub and shower hooked up, ready to go. Beautifully stylish tile walling around this tub. Really nice. Okay, now we'll go ahead and check out the third floor, which is the loft area. So this loft space could be used in a multitude of ways. Um, it does have a carpet flooring throughout and it's a lot of space up here. So realistically, you could end up using this maybe as storage. Uh, you could end up using this maybe as an in-law unit. Uh, it has plenty of space for really a, uh, you know, a queen bed set, but it's really up to you on how you use it. But again, I could see it as a storage area, a hangout space, you know, gaming setup up here, whatever you end up choosing it as you have lots of opportunity on this third floor. Top of that, there's the mini split, as mentioned previously. So that is basically it. So once again, this is 377 Gas Kill Street, located in Woonsocket, Rhode Island. Four bedrooms, one and a half bathroom, single family home. Before I go, I'd like to remind everybody as always to please subscribe to the Nexus Property Management YouTube channel. That way you can keep up to date with all of the listings that we have available on our website. And of course, any news related to real estate, and property management will be located there as well. Thank you very much.